Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Dexter 12 inch by 2 inch right hand electric trailer brake assembly for 7,000 pound axles. Now these electric brakes are a lot easier to install. They offer more user control than hydraulic brakes. They require only an electric brake controller, which we do sell separately on our website. There's no need for any actuator or hydraulic lines necessary. Now this kit includes the 12 inch by 2 inch passenger side electric trailer brake assembly, which is the right hand side. And the brake shoes on this assembly, they are lined with a nice automotive grade friction material. And that friction material is fully bonded to the shoe, it's not riveted, gives you a lot longer life, more braking torque. Now this assembly is a manual adjustment brake assembly, it requires periodic manual adjustment of the brakes. And you adjust them by going to the back here and there's two holes at the very bottom that you can put your brake tool through or your screwdriver to adjust the brakes. And what's nice about it, if you notice, they do include these plastic adjuster plugs that cover those access holes. And that's nice because it helps keep the dirt and grime out of the brake assemblies and off of your shoes. And you can also see that it is designed to fit a five bolt brake mounting flange bolt pattern. And it does come with the included mounting hardware to install it onto your brake mounting flange. This part is made in the USA. Application for this, it's designed to fit most standard hub and drum assemblies, including Dexter, Lippert, and Alco. Now when they say this is a 12 inch by two inch, that measurement, what they're talking about, the 12 inch is the diameter. So that would be measured from this shoe to this shoe. So if we put a ruler on it, there's your 12 inch measurement. The two inch, that's gonna be the width of the pad on the brake shoe. So if we take our ruler, measure the width, there's your two inch width. And this brake assembly does have a 3,500 pound weight capacity or weight rating. So when this is matched with one on the other side of the axle, it'll meet the 7,000 pound axle rating. This is designed to work with 12 inch brake drums. This does fit the wheel size of 14 and a half inch to 16 and a half inch diameter wheels. And these are electric brakes. So you can see the wires here in the back. They have two wires that need to be connected. They're both black wires. One goes to the brake feed, one goes to the ground. And they're the same, so you can use either wire for either function. And the last thing I do want to mention is, the nice thing to know is this is a right-hand or passenger side assembly. And the way you can tell that, now when you get a new one, of course, it'll have a ta uh, sticker here that'll say right-hand. But if that sticker wasn't on there, the way you'd be able to tell is just look at the length of the pad on the shoe. So the pad on this brake shoe goes from here to here. On this brake shoe is all the way from here to here. So this is the sh smaller pad, this is the large, longer pad. The smaller pad is your primary shoe. That will always face the front of the trailer. So you'll know that'll go this way, which will mean it's for the passenger side of your trailer. But that should do it for the review on the Dexter 12 inch by two inch right hand electric trailer brake assembly for 7,000 pound axles.